Back to you, Duotech Combi, seventh year service. This is gonna be a full strip down service. So switch the boiler off, turn the gas off, remove the burner. Take all the electrodes off. And I just gave the burner a clean with a soft brush initially. Then I've just moved on to electrodes, cleaned it with a abrasive strip, moved back on to the heat exchanger with a more abrasive brush, a more stronger metal brush. Then after this, I've moved on and I've pulled out my Karcher bad boy set. That there, you've got to be careful with this because water does go everywhere. Yes, but be very careful. Heat exchanger is now nice and clean, lovely jubbly. Got a little hoover at the bottom. Why not give it a clean, change the gasket. And now I'm just putting it all back together. Now, I like to do things in stages. Now this area is done, so I like to reset and put it all back together. So I know where all the wires go, the cables go. And there's no you know confusion about it now i'm going to move on to the water section of the boiler the filter is sideways it's always been sideways it catches the dirt it does the job now i'm servicing the, the filter i always like to put the lube around the o-ring it makes my life a lot easier when i'm going to come back and service it the reason i've opened up the iso there is because now i'm using this filter to drain the boiler I don't like to use the internal drain offs, I find they leak after a while. I've put a little bit of silicone grease on the expansion vessel here to stop that pin from leaking. It was alright, but I always just do this anyway. Recharge the vessel, get all the water out of the boiler completely. Now I've reversed the process, fit the filter back, open up the water, fill the system back up to one and a half bar. Once the system's at 1.5 bar, I'll move on to switching the boiler on and I'll test the hot water straight away. Test the hot water, make sure that was fine. I'm just checking the flame picture. And I've got this little tester here, my little gas sniffer from Amazon. It's a really good little handy device to have. Pulled out my TPI, do my FGA on it. And now I'm gonna show you guys how to put this boiler into max, minimum max. So turn everything to zero quarter turn twice on the hot water dial and then the central heating dial turn that to max for maximum and min for minimum check my inlet i've done a gas rate everything sound the job's done